Hello. Hey. Hey, hey guys, how are you? Good. It was good. a good presentation. Thank you. Oh, thank you. My pleasure. I hope everyone enjoyed. It was fun to put together. Obviously, we much prefer explaining it over a glass or two in Amsterdam, but um, it was uh, nearly as much fun doing it digitally. So, yeah. Well, I have questions from that. Please. Uh, as you know, this is for Inspiration Day, right? So how do you first started thinking about using vintage in terms of design inspiration for brands? Uh, so I guess, I guess I kind of fell into it really. It was, um, I used to have a, a stall for many years on Portobello Road on a Friday and uh, the, the market is a great market still, but then it was really in its sort of heyday. And I started to see a lot of, you know, these crazy big name designers walking around looking for inspiration. And I thought, this is great. I don't have to worry about who it's going to fit or who's going to wear it. I can just find beautiful pieces and, uh, you know, hopefully someone will come along. If I think it's beautiful, someone else will think it's beautiful and they'll use it for, a, for an idea or a concept. So I think that really springboarded the idea of putting a kind of archive together. So I think Roy and myself started working together around 13 years ago. And the idea was we had this almost like a museum of menswear that designers could use as a library. And uh, yeah, it just, it's just kind of rolled on from there really. So it's been, it's a lot more fun. Well, I mean, I love selling pieces that people wear, but it's, uh, it's in some ways it's probably more fun to, to buy for designers. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so is there a particular peer of, or person inspire you the most? I don't know. I mean, I think like, so for this week, we've, I definitely feel what I said in the, in the presentation that we, we look at, we look at movies a lot. And I think definitely as a kid growing up, you know, there wasn't the choice there was now. So it was always reruns of old Hollywood movies. So I, I'm kind of guess that, that post second world war fifties Americana or the kind of dream of that fifties period is is what really got me hooked on vintage when i think of all the all the films i love and all the pieces i love i i think probably the 50s definitely in terms of denim uh, it, it really had all the all the bits that i'm kind of crazy for and then i, I think it was quite nice the misfits in, in a lot of ways is a lot darker and sadder film than a lot of the you know the generic westerns that i would have watched as a kid but I, I, it's when I look at the stills now, even I was looking through the book of the movie earlier today, it's just amazing the pieces in there. And it was just the be beautiful wardrobe really was. Well, so I guess, you know, cause we have so sh short time. My last question is what is the most difficult part to start an idea? Oh, I don't know. I mean, it's, it's funny, a lot of, I think ideas are like sometimes you can get lost down the sort of rabbit hole of design. So you go in this almost kind of stream of consciousness of, uh, of pieces and ideas. And sometimes you start with something and you end up and you forget what you start with. But I, I kind of always embrace that. And I like, I like kind of doing it. We had to hold it together for the presentation though. So we had to keep the uh, storm rider jacket in as the main piece. But um, yeah, I think design can you, there's no, I think in creativity, there shouldn't really be any mistakes. So you can just go on a bit of an adventure. I always love the, I love that kind of concept stage in a project. I guess that's why people love you so much, right? Oh, of course. <laughs> <laughs> and, that, and I'm so easy to work with. <laughs> well, well, I miss you guys. Okay. Sorry we couldn't do it in person. I know. <laughs> I wish we can go to London one day, just like last time. You yeah, know? that'd be great. Yeah. yeah. So thank you so much for joining us. Well, we thank you for inviting me. We have to yeah. run <laughs> and talk to you really soon. Thank you. Thanks, Andrew. Yeah, Doug. Take care. Nice to see you.